In this video, I'll be showing you how to protect your Facebook account from any unauthorized access using the two-factor authentication, which is the 2FA. So the, the two-factor authentication is like an additional layer of security for your Facebook account. So it comes in, in, in a way like whenever you tried logging into your Facebook account, even after imputing your password, a code will be sent to your phone number. To your phone number particularly a phone will be sent to your phone number to further confirm you are the one trying to log into your facebook account so guys i'll be quickly walking us through this simple process hi my name is olushola daniel guys so let's jump right into the business of the day so you open your facebook account this way what you want to do is if you're accessing your facebook um through your laptop then you want to go to your settings your facebook settings click on the account then go to settings and privacy click on settings then once it loads up you want to further scroll down to um to account to security and login security and login so click on security and login then you should see it then you further scroll down again then this is it you should find something like this two-factor authentication so what you want to do next is to click on the um this particular aspect of the um screen which is use two-factor authentication we will ask for a login code if we notice an attempted login from an unrecognized device or browser now guys what this does is it helps you protect your facebook account from any unauthorized access particularly from hackers from dangerous people so that they do not have access to your personal details so it is it is a very good um step to take it is something you should do to protect your facebook account if you have once lost access to any of your facebook accounts then you know it could be very frustrating and painful so in order to avoid something like that you should definitely set up two-factor authentication to protect your facebook account so guys as i was saying what you are going to do now is you click on edit this way like this account i'm actually using to show you guys this particular account has two-factor authentication set up on it already but I'll still go further to show you how to do that. So what you want to do next is you click on edit this way, then it should bring up, um, it should load a page whereby you'd see the, um, if you've included it before, then you should load up a page whereby you see the previous number in case you want to change the number to a new number. But if you have not added it before, then you should see something like hard phone number. Now let's click on um, leave page, let it open. Now here we are guys, as you can see here now, it says help protect your account if we notice any attempted login from a device or browser we don't recognize, we will ask for your password and a verification code. Now these are several um, ways you can actually set up two-factor authentication, it could be through um, an authentication app which you can google further to um, search on this but the way you do it you can download um, google authentication whereby whenever you try to log in the um there's a way it's been done a code will be sent automatically to your google authentication app but just to avoid the stress guy let's just make do with the sms aspect of the two-factor authentication now what you want to do with the sms is you click on use text message so whenever anybody tries logging in let's say they already have your password they've been able to either in one way or the other they've been able to get your password and they tried logging in whenever they impute your password and they click on the submit button they will further be asked for a code the code will be sent to this phone number and the code would be must be imputed before the person will be able to gain access to your facebook account and i want to believe you are the owner of your own phone number you don't give it to anybody so once you receive the code like that then you should know something is definitely fishy on your facebook account you should dash to your facebook accounts and make some changes very quickly that means somebody is trying to access your facebook account so what you want to do is you click on use text message like this 
and it will require it will um, request for your password so it, it will require your password like this so now what you want to do is you still impute your password in case now the essence of this is in case you are already logged into a, a, um, a laptop and somebody um, eventually um, gets access to the password um, to you to the laptop and your Facebook is still logged into the password and the person tries doing something fishy behind your back you know you've already logged in yourself and probably you went somewhere or you forgot to log out and another person has access to the um, to the Facebook to your Facebook account and the person tries to do something very fishy this is another aspect to make sure you are the one trying to um, change or set up two-factor authentication on the account so it's not the case whereby the person will just click on it and the person will just add the phone number and you you've you've lost your account that way so facebook will further ask for your password in order for you to set up the two-factor authentication all these are a way of securing your account now guys you go further to submit the password let me submit this password so you can see what's next to do now it's going to ask for a phone number like this you understand now it says this phone number will be enabled for two-factor authentication i actually thought this is one of my accounts i have already set up two-factor authentication on but thank god it's it's good for this tutorial i've actually not set up any two-factor authentication and i might not even set it up now because i don't even have a phone number to hard maybe later i can do that but this is just a way to walk you guys through this process now the next thing you are going to do now is to impute the phone number then once you are done imputing the fo phone number then follow prompts just click on continue then you follow prompts follow prompts follow whatever step facebook asks you to um to take and within few minutes you are done setting up two factor authentication on your facebook account nobody will be able to gain any access to it except you give them th the code and in any case if anyone is trying to access your facebook account with your password and they got to the stage where they they, they are being asked to provide a code and they eventually call you maybe anybody calls you like a code has been sent to your phone can you please send the code to us then the person is trying to gain access to your facebook account you have to be watchful you have to be careful you have to be conscious of um calls or text messages like that because we've seen cases whereby people try to um to lay hold of other people's accounts and they call the person requesting for a code the person out of you might not even know out of your own unsuspicious you might not know and you just for the code to this thing i'm telling you is actually real I, I i have somebody that has fallen victim to this this is why i'm sharing it so it might sound ridiculous but it's actually um, an opportunity for you to learn so in case anybody tries getting access to your facebook and they they, they they eventually get to a stage where they are being asked to provide the code and they call you to request for a code be very careful don't provide the code once you provide the code the person will gain express access to your facebook accounts and the person will be able to change every of your details you understand you if you are able to provide the code the person will gain access to your facebook and the very first thing the person will do is to change your email address and to remove your phone number with that you won't be able to gain access to that facebook account again no matter what you try your chances of getting it back is five percent out of hundred percent you have 95 percent of losing the account even if you reach out to the facebook um facebook um, support team it's it's going to look somehow they won't be able to help you because you don't have anything to prove that you are the owner of the account so this is the essence of the two-factor authentication account to further protect your facebook account so guys like i said you impute the number here then you click on continue and you follow prompts before you know it you are done setting up the two-factor authentication for your facebook account so guys that will be all for setting up two-factor authentication on your facebook accounts from your laptop so guys i'll be going back now i'll be going back now let me go back to my facebook so that's it guys that's it guys that's it guys this other particular video this one this particular video is going to show you how to enable two-factor authentication from your mobile phone 
how to enable two-factor authentication for your Facebook account on your mobile phone on your mobile phone so what you want to do is you go straight to your Facebook um, account your Facebook app then this is um, a bit much easier then what you want to do is once you've been able to gain access to your Facebook account like this on your Facebook app then the next thing you want to do is you click on this place just click on it like this let me click on it so it takes me there have you seen it so the next thing you want to do is you scroll down to security to settings rather settings and privacy then you click on settings and privacy so this is actually how you are going to set up two-factor authentication for your Facebook accounts on your mobile phone so once it opens up like this you click on um, settings then from settings you scroll down to security and login this is it here security and login then click on security and login then you can see the devices that are um, logged into your Facebook account so you just scroll down a bit then you find two-factor authentication this particular account I'm very sure I have two-factor authentication set up but that doesn't still stop me from showing you how to set this up on your mobile phone so now you click on this use two-factor authentication it will ask for a login code if we notice an attempted login from an unrecognized device or browser so just click on it like this and get inside so as you can see I already have a phone number attached to this Facebook account for two-factor authentication so in your own case it's going to ask you to add a phone number so the next thing you want to do is you click on it then once you click on it now it's telling me use different phone number so in this case probably you have um, a phone number added before and you are trying to change the phone number so you can follow this process then you click on use different phone number so from here you just input the new phone number which you want to add to the Facebook account this is for two-factor authentication not the bio this is for two-factor authentication so and this process is for um, changing the former phone number to a new phone number now in your own case if you are setting it up for the first time you are likely to see after clicking on this particular um, two-factor authentication you should find a place to click on which will require you to it's it, it's going to look like use two-factor authentication for this account so once you click on it it's going to take you to um, to another um, page whereby it will ask you to to it will ask you to either enable two-factor authentication using um, using um, an app or using um, some other means like that but make sure you select text message SMS text message SMS just follow the way I'm describing it I won't be able to show you that now because I already have two-factor authentication set up on this particular Facebook account so this is a way for you to set it up from your mobile phone so now make sure you use um, the text um, message um, two-factor authentication that's the text message SMS so once you click on it then it tells you to to input the phone number you want to use so once you input the phone number it might require a password you understand it might require that you input your password it might request for your password so just input your password is just another way to be sure that you are the one trying to set up the two-factor authentication so just um, input your password and follow prompts input the phone number and you are going to get a code you are going to get a code you get a code on that particular phone number so you input the code and you follow prompts before you know it you are done setting up two-factor authentication for your Facebook accounts on your mobile phone it's still the same thing if you're able to do it from your mobile phone it will take effect on your account generally so you don't have to set it up on your mobile phone and you go back to your laptop and still try to set it up it will take effect everywhere it's going to take effect so now guys this is actually the way it's going to look so with that i think i've been able to walk you through how to set up two-factor authentication for your facebook accounts on your mobile phone but i'll further go um i'll further go ahead to see if i can show you how the view is going to look like on on mobile phone let me first minimize this 
there's a way you can um, actually make your browser look like a mobile phone let me bring it down then let me see I just hope let me see okay now guys this is it this is okay this is awesome this is awesome so this is actually how the mobile view is going to look like from your um, phone this is the mobile view but I'm using a browser now this is the mobile view this is it so I'm, I'm able to do this because I minimized my browser and I shrinked it to a mobile phone um, screen screen resolution so this is typically how a mobile phone Facebook app would look like now let me walk you through the process once again because I don't have a um, two-factor authentication set up on this particular account so you can see everything I just explained earlier now follow this account like this let me put it side by side so you can see it it's almost the same thing it's almost the same thing let me bring this back up don't get distracted I just want to show you it's almost the same as you can see the view is almost the same thing let me come back here the view is almost the same thing as you can see guys the view is almost the same thing now you want to click on account like this which is here this place so you want to click on account like this let me see so I think I'll be let me just leave this one out let me use this one to walk you guys through so I don't distract you click on account accounts go to settings and privacy this is most likely how it's going to look like on your mobile phone then click on settings then from the settings you scroll down to um, you scroll down to security and login security and login so this is most likely how it's going to look like on your Facebook app okay then you might have something like this then you scroll down to use two-factor authentication so I was trying to explain this the other time so from your mobile app this is definitely what you are going to see then you want to click on let me you want to click on it this way let me say leave page then it's going to take you to another page where it will give you three options to select from either you use either you use um select security method that's either you use an authentication app or you use security key or you use text message this way i hope you guys understand that so from your mobile app you click on use text message then it's my prompt for your password impute the password to be sure that you are the one trying to set up the two-factor authentication then the next thing is for you to impute that particular phone number you want to attach to the Facebook account to set up the two-factor authentication so once you you are able to impute the phone number then you click on continue you are definitely going to get a code on that phone number the code which you are going to impute back into a dialog box that will be provided after this page because you'll be required to enter the verification code so once you enter the verification code then you can confirm before you know it within few seconds you've been able to set up two-factor authentication for your Facebook account on your mobile phone so guys I hope with that I've been able to walk you through this simple process to set up two-factor authentication on your mobile phone and your um your your laptop I remain Olusha Daniel guys Make sure you're always having a great time. Bye for now.